Yo, what's up? Welcome back to my channel again. My name is Paul. If you're new to my channel, please like, share, and subscribe, and also hit the bell icon so that you can get more updates about my day-to-day -day life. So today I'm here at Enchanted Forest. I got connected through Instagram, and uh, I really wanted to check this place. This place is really awesome. I just had my whole overview view about this place, and uh, I felt really peaceful. So I'm gonna show you about this place. So till then, stay to you. So that, what you're seeing is that the small, small ball thingy, ball. that is the Chinese apple. So if you're lucky, you might get to taste one as well. You can play with the dog as well, if you're stressed. This is really awesome for couples and also for the best friends. I'm just here today to see around. So in future, if I want to stay with my friend and chill. So till then, stay tuned. So let me show you around this enchanted forest how it exactly looks. Let me, let me introduce to the owner of this place. The owner of this place, Enchanted Forest. So, do you have to say anything about this place specifically for the couples and for the friends who wants to come and chill around? Yes, sure. I would like to just to give you a small brief you guys about uh, the farm. So, this is a farm. We call it Enchanted Forest Farm. We've got three cottages in total. There, you see there, there's the walnut cottage because it is in close proximity to the walnut tree which is at the background the tall tree that you see without the leaves that's a walnut tree which actually bears the fruit so hence we've named that cottage walnut it's a private cottage for couples mostly sought after by couples in addition to that we have these two uh, duplex units which are identical and side by side uh, it's a beautifully designed cottage initially we started this as a you know a barn for keeping the cows and since we had to you know there was some change in plan then we had to redo the thing and we made it into a uh, guest cottage so these are the three units that we have as of now hopefully in the future we might have one or two but not many because that will spoil the charm of the place and it will become like just another resort you know so and if you look this side uh, this entire stretch, the you know the downhill, uh, the forest that you see is a part of the property. It is 18 acres in total. It goes all the way till the stream from this corner that you are facing right now to the left-hand corner, the extreme left, and which you cannot see actually. It's uh, pretty far off actually. The the border for this land, the demarcation. So this is all forested, we haven't touched it, it's serene and in the future we might just have a tree house and one more unit, that's it. We would like to preserve the ecosystem. So yeah, it's... Yeah, and I've also checked your website. Uh -huh. I've seen a lot of people who come here who click pictures through the riverside. And uh, yeah, you have your personal river or where yeah, people usually sort of, go yeah, there and you know, swim. You know. So yeah, it's a good place for, you know, friends and for couples, especially couples because that place is really for just couples you know they can just come here and then have a quality time so without I'll show you around yeah without getting
it looks really beautiful. Beautiful, awesome, chill. And uh, yeah, the person who's shooting video right now is Baby K. None other than Baby K. Oh, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> this is orange. Sorry about the background. What do you call the sound? It's a little disturbing. So yeah, so I'll show you around. So then stay tuned, I'll do some cinematic video. They have their own personal hammock, but only you will get to sit in this hammock if you book that place. Can you show that place? Yes. So if the couples are watching this video right now, and if you guys are interested to come here, you all can book that room, sleep here, sit there. You can do whatever you want to do. Outdoor dining. Some string lights, fairy lights, and a small barbecue stand. Outdoor dining. Here. So we'll be covering this up. I'm sure it's going to look really beautiful in the night. I, yeah, it does. It does. It really looks nice. And, and uh, you can do a bonfire as well. Yeah, yes. Yeah. And uh, we uh, all, we've also you know, have, uh, we've also done some candlelight dinners for our guests here. We set it up. We set up with this. We put some fairy lights, string lights, and a lot of candles to add to the beauty, and it looks really spectacular at night. And this is our dining area under construction, which will be the indoor dining area. It is still under construction. This is our small kitchen, which will be extended. And you, as you see around, these are all oranges and guavas and lots of fruiting trees peaches, plums. This place is really awesome. So one thing really caught my eyes is all these pickles. Uh, there's a the radish. Uh, so one thing in Hill Station people, they, they usually make all these kind of uh, pickles at home. So this is all organic. So you, can, you get to taste all these things as well. And uh, also, you can get your own drinks, you know, you can have friends around, you can chill around and at the same time you can order food from here. They have all this uh, homemade food specially. So, you know, home, f far away from home. Where are you going? Home away from home, yeah. Home away from home, yeah. So, yeah. It's really nice place. I'm sure you know 
you'll have more customers coming right. here. And thank uh, you so much yeah. for the wishes. And we'll come to show. And we'll come with the friends. Please, yeah, yeah. Please so, do. Yeah. Thank you. Really for enjoyed. That. Yeah. Uh, and make sure you follow you his uh, uh -huh. website and also on Instagram. Please, yeah. yeah. Instagram it goes by the name Enchanted Forest Farm. Yes. If you can, you know, uh, show some love and spread the word, it'll be really helpful. And uh, most importantly, you guys, please come over. It was a short, it was a brief visit, but then if you could come over for a night or two, you guys will really enjoy this place, uh, for it is very serene and quiet. So yeah, that's about it. Thank you. Awesome. It's time to say goodbye to Enchanted Forest. This is the last entrance. So yeah. And we really had fun and also a good cup of tea. So make sure you guys follow this enchanted forest on Instagram like they have their own page and also a website. So make sure you give like and also follow and make sure you come here and feel the nature. You're close to nature and also you feel calm. Oh. Okay, so uh, we have finally reached the main road you have to hike down and up as well like total 30 minutes maybe 15 minutes up 15 minutes down so we just hiked for like 15 minutes and now it's time to go home so yeah and thank you for watching like subscribe and hit the bell icon for more updates